In this tutorial, we will learn how to create a terrain model in SketchUp for the house you are designing. First, make the Location tool and Sandbox tool available. Go to View and then you will find Location and Sandbox tool and then make them turn down. Click the Location button to find your dream location or real location for the site and enter the address, define region, then import. Here is the 3D terrain model by SketchUp. You can switch between 2D and 3D views of the train. To be able to work on the terrain model, click white mouse button and click Unlock. There are other methods. The second method is with the topo lines. You need lines first, otherwise you will get the error message. Each line should be in different height. For this demo, random height. The blue dotted line means it's moving straight up along the blue axis. Select them all, then click the Contour tool in the Sandbox toolbar, and that's what you have. The third method is from Scratch tool. You can determine the grid spacing. Using Smooth tool, you can create hills and valleys. Simply type the number for the brush size in any chosen unit. You can see the height and depth in the input box as you script the train. Let's move the house over and then see how we can place the house on the site using stamp tool. Select the house and click the stamp tool and then pick the terrain model. Let's try a more interesting place. Move your mouse around and pick to complete the stamp command. That's where the platform is for the building. Let's practice the stamp tool over the location-based terrain model. The building is currently selected and then pick stamp tool and then finally the terrain. And adjust the height of the platform. If the deck appears to be too small, you can quickly create a deck around the house using Offset tool. I'm going to offset the bottom of the house. But you can also use this pencil tool to draw the deck in any shape. Let's give a little thickness to the deck. Now we are ready for the stamp tool, step 1, 2, 3. Here we go. For further scripting and fine tuning of the train model, use Add Detail and Flip Edge tool. We did not cover Drape tool today. It can be very useful, works very much like stamp tool, but it creates lines for roads or uh, driveway edges and ponds. Uh, I want you to try yourself. This is it. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.